Richardson ISD students have the drive to succeed. The Lake Highlands High School Ballet Folklorico team has the trophies to prove it. Noelle Walker was at their rehearsal this morning. All right, good morning, good morning, good morning. All right, we ready? And one. This first period class at Lake Highlands High School, there are no books. There's ballet. Ballet Folklorico. Oh, the hardest thing about it is learning Three, the steps. Four, five, six, but seven, Ballet Folklorico and one is more two. than the steps. It has a lot of emotion, a lot of feelings. And uh, da, da, da. It's also part of the seven, curriculum ten. One at two, Lake Highlands. Three. It's important to not only have Folklorico because it is dancing, but also because it's specific to a culture. I feel like it's more of a culture getting together. Okay, here we go, from the top. These folklorical students make the grade in more ways than one. The team recently competed in the Valle de Mi Tierra competition in Austin. At first, uh, it just made me feel like, oh, I'm nervous, a lot of people are looking at me and I'm just like, oh God, please, I don't want to mess up in front of anybody. They didn't mess up. The team took home eight trophies, three for first place. Every song that we have a routine to, I be singing the whole song. Like putting a whole routine together and then showing it off to people and being like, this is what I do. From the start. So we are currently rehearsing for our Cinco de Mayo show, which is our big end of year production. I hope they're walking away feeling confident in themselves. The world is their stage. You guys are great. Thank you for your hard work today. In Dallas, Noelle Walker, NBC5. Lake Highlands High School was first in Richardson ISD to have a ballet folklorico team. The district has expanded it to other schools.